this is my canvas art so far. It's as far as I've gotten. And here's some real life for you. If this makes anyone feel better on this Friday, then it makes me feel better too. So when I'm doing a project, everything gets thrown around in here in the middle of our kitchen and dining room. And there's the map cabinet coffee table that I need to refinish. That's the bookshelf that Trav finished for me that I need to refinish. Oh, and look at this swan. I think I want to keep it like this. And I do want to say I don't have to do projects or refinish things. I just love doing it. It's like a hobby for me. But I think I want to keep this swan this color. I kind of like how it looks antiqued and stuff. This is the smaller one that I'm going to refinish. Looks pretty gross. And a bunch of you were saying how Kathy, this is how I opened the hutch. Uh, my friend on here redid her swan planter. It's in her safe stories and it turned out really cute. So thank you for telling me that. I love Kathy and she has amazing style. I just haven't found any hardware that I love enough yet to put on this hutch. So I use this paint can opener. <laughs> I wanted to show you this. I just got that in the mail from my friend Melanie from One Day in France. I've showed you some things that she has sent me in the past. She has all kind of just like amazing old antique pottery. I mean, and lots of other stuff too, not just pottery. But isn't that so cool? Lots of character. I love these old pottery pieces. That's why I'm always trying to make mine look like that. This one's from her too, from a while back. So pretty. Another one from her too. Remember how Caden broke this? Trav super glued it back together for me. See the crack right there? And it worked so far. So I'll put her shop in the swipe up here. She has tons of good stuff and yay for a code. I have to go to Hobby Lobby now to get something for my canvas that I'm gonna try out. What a pain, right? And before I do, I want to share my friend Carly with you. She's been sharing a lot of home inspo pictures and stuff because they're redoing, they're like renovating their house. And she has this really cool, I just saw this on her stories yesterday. It's like a really deep, dark green color. I'm excited to see what she's gonna do with that. And her house is probably gonna be done a long time before ours. And I know you guys enjoy that kind of stuff. So I thought I'd share. Check out her most recent Save Story Circle. I think it says Reno 4 and it, she walks through the house and shows like all the plans that they have. It looks so cool and what they're going to put up the fireplace. She's really fun to follow. She has a little girl and a baby boy on the way. She shares lots of family and lifestyle stuff. Who else knew that Hobby Lobby doesn't accept the coupons anymore? Do they not put hot fudge on hot fudge Sundays anymore either? Did George Washington not marry Martha? Are we all really alive right now? The javelina, like the salt lick. <laughs> oh, oh, they're fighting with each other over it. There's the badger. And the coyote walking after it. Mm. It runs away. Couldn't the badger, like, attack the coyote? Yeah, I don't think the coyote really wants the badger. No? no. Probably rip well. it to show. Are you showing us? I'm showing you the bad cat. <laughs> The bobcat in the shadows. Oh, yeah, I thought he was going to come out. He's right here. He's going to walk across. And there's the deer that we've been waiting for. <laughs> that doesn't like the salt lick. They don't like the liquors. Staring at something. Mm-hmm. It's that UFO up there in the sky. Is it, Trav? Mm -hmm. It's a three-dot flying object. 